in many ways a reflection of the community that we uh, live in. And it was meant to be a, a business that was deeply involved in the community, and so therefore what that involvement would be, and what level, at what level and what detail it would be, it had a lot to do with uh, what people were interested in, and uh, how, they want, how they view their community, how they want their community to exist. Uh, we're, we're fortunate here, in, in especially Carborough specifically, I'd say, that we have a very eclectic community and uh, one that uh, values a great many things that um, allow us to sort of embrace that community and help support those things that they support as well. For, for better or worse, and I think for better mostly, we have been coined as Carborough's living room. And I think that does a does it fair justice? <laughs> I think there's uh, certainly a lot of uh, element to that where people feel comfortable here. And that was one of the big goals was to make it inviting and comfortable. And so I think that speaks to that pretty well. Um, someone who walks in hopefully feels that comfort and, and uh, feels at home, so to speak. Uh, but behind that sort of comfort level and behind that uh, mystique of, of feeling at home, uh, is a really high-end, sort of cutting-edge uh, coffee experience and, and more as, as we sort of relate uh, to all the products that we sell, whether it be your wine or food, the same way we do our coffee as, as a, a quality uh, gourmet experience. Right from the start, you know, um, being athletes ourselves uh, as owners, I think, maybe made that a little more conducive, but I think that it would happen anyway. Um, because there's so many people who are active <laughs> here in the community. And so whether it's cycling or running or mount, you know, rock climbing or mountain biking or uh, uh, kayaking, it, it, it doesn't really matter. I mean, obviously we can't uh, help the kayakers here that much except fuel them up. But uh, we, we wanted to, to sort of embrace the, uh, all aspects of the community and that was a big part of it, for sure. We, we're big believers in what the, the trailheads are standing for, specifically in, in these races. Um, you know, Philosopher's Way is, is a poignant one in the sense that it, it has such a direct connection to the outdoors and a specific area uh, that we all hold dear um, and, and, and value. And I think that that was certainly uh, something we thought of when it came to sponsoring the race. It didn't necessarily have to be about this specific area, although since it is one that we utilize so, high, so much and value so highly, um, it's one that we really wanted to get behind. And you know, we, we, we sponsor a lot of athletic endeavors um, around the area uh, because we believe in the athletic lifestyle, a healthy lifestyle, and, and really keeping um, uh, a happy, healthy life. But you know, the stuff that we've been doing uh, from the beginning, from the very first uh, races that the trainers have put on, um, we feel um, there's a, a, a little more kinship maybe than, than just your average 5K, road 5K, or whatever. Uh, because uh, it's it's uh, it's an experience that we treasure, and we would like everybody to treasure.